Tensar's geogrids have been used to stabilise rail ballast and sub ballast for the last 30 years. This application has been backed up by full-scale laboratory testing and also by live site trials which have been carried out since the mid-1980s. This has demonstrated that Tensar's geogrids are a cost-effective way of increasing track bed stiffness and also of establishing and maintaining good track geometry. A tensar geogrid mechanically interlocks with the granular fill used in track bed. The resulting stabilising effect of including a geogrid reduces the rate of track settlement and traffic induced ballast degradation. Research has shown that this can double and in some cases quadruple the time between maintenance periods, potentially halving maintenance costs and achieving payback on using geogrid in fewer than three tamping visits. Research by the University of Nottingham in the United Kingdom and the Czech Technical University in Prague, amongst others, has also compared the performance of Tensar's biaxial and triax geogrids in track ballast and sub ballast. Results show that using triax means sleeper settlement is reduced further when compared with the same track bed, including a Tensar biaxial geogrid, and track bed life can be up to 10 times longer than non stabilised ballast. Research also confirmed that, once again, the ultimate tensile strength of the geogrid is not a useful way of predicting track bed performance. Tensile Triax TX190L holds a current Network Rail Product Acceptance Certificate in the United Kingdom to allow rail engineers to benefit from the improved performance of stabilised ballasted track on the United Kingdom rail network. Tensile Triax geogrids hold European Technical Approval or an ETA, which defines and confirms its stabilisation function. The ETA acknowledges the improvement available in the design life of a granular layer incorporating a tensile triax geogrid when included in railway applications. <laughs>